this flyweight fight. So a more than five year gap between these two fighters when it comes to the age, with similar height and some differences in reach. Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC flyweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. A jiu-jitsu fighter, holding professional record eyes. 14 wins, five losses. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 125 pounds. Brandon, the assassin baby, Marino! And now, if you see his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. A jiu-jitsu fighter, holding a professional record eye. 22 wins, 5 losses. He stands 5 feet 5 inches tall, weighing in at 125 pounds. Fighting out of the top, Brazil, Chusier Formiga! And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the afternoon is Steve Lovig. The veteran Eve Levine draws the assignment here. Are you ready? You ready? And we are underway. Side leg kick is there by the assassin baby, Brandon Moreno. Opens with the left hand and lands flush. Oh, spinning back because he solved it right there. Very nice. Really missed with that right hand. Well, straight right hand has been a good weapon for him. He misses with it there. Changes his stance. Well, Joe, you gotta fault the strategy here. I'm not saying he's a bet on the opponent, but he's moving right into that straight punch and right into his opponent's striking range. He would be wise to get his head off of the center line and stop leaning in. Right on the button. Oh, good combination. Lands a punch. He clipped him again. Oh, landed that inside leg kick. Already a wealth on his opponent. And he caught the kick. We'll see what he can do with it. Blocks the shot to the body. Strong takedown defense there, Joe. Single leg attempt, no They are trading huge punches here. Slips to avoid the left. Oh, roundhouse kick. Add that to his highlight reel. Three minutes remain in the round. Big kick, but miss. Nice. And he switches to southpaw here yet again. Splits the guard and connects with the punch. Beautiful right leg kick there. Good exchanges from both fighters. Formiga gets hit by that leg kick. Oh, he got cracked. Straight right hand now just misses. Good straight hand there by Formiga. And just misses with that big right hand. Moreno gets caught with that punch. He's treading water now. Got to find a way to move those feet. Under two minutes now to go in the opening round. Moreno gets hit with a kick here. Let's see how he responds. And he's looking for that left. Joe. He's vulnerable to that straight punch. If he's going to move forward and keep his body and his head on that center line, he's going to pay for it. He certainly did that. He avoids the clinch. Oh, and he 
connects there. Well, he misses with the left punch there. Under a minute to go. Switching stances here. Good combination so far from both men. Well, it's one thing to have length, it's another thing to use it, and he does it as well as anyone. Nice kick there by Brandon Moreno. Oh, head kick attempt, that one's clean. For me, his leg appears to be hurt here, Joe. That is an obvious left. Oh, man, with that right leg kick. That one hurt. Beautiful jab, beautiful jab, sharp timing. He switched again to southpaw. Lands a, lands a right hand up Oh, huge right hand! So a strong five minutes down. Oh, what a way to end the round. Saved by the bell. He got stunned by a huge shot right before the horn. And now, a little bit gingerly, he makes his way back to the stool. And he's only got 60 seconds to recover here. So we'll see if his corner, physically, mentally, can keep this fighter in the fight. And let's get a better look at it from a different angle. Brittany Palmer holding it down for us here. Are you ready? Are you ready? Second round underway. Look for him to go on the attack early in this round to try to pick up where he left off in the last round. His opponent was dazed and in big trouble when that round ended. Landed some excellent shots in this fight tonight, but more often than not, it has been one and done. So the emphasis now moving forward, combinations. Throw your punches in bunches. Oh! He hurt him. He's got him right here. Oh, he might be out. Well, that kick landed the body beautifully placed right underneath that elbow. Let's see if he makes the adjustments now defensively to avoid opening up that midsection to further damage by that kick. Look at that, right to the temple. How about that chin? Roundhouse kick lands. Obvious redness on the right side of his body. And he continues to work on the inside of that lead leg. Constantly a moving target. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection. And these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. Couldn't agree with you more. Whiffs on the straight right hand. Oh, powerful right leg kick. Doubled up on the jab there. Nicely done by Formiga. Back to the inside leg kick. Great exchanges. Under three minutes now to go on the round. Missed with that right hand. Leg attempt here. Nice job to catch the leg and work it into a takedown. Oh, going for a choke here, Joe. This could be dangerous. It looks like he's got that arm triangle locked in tight. That choke is deep. Wow. Inside control. Strike landed there by Formiga. Moves to north-south. Excellent movement on the ground here. Always trying to better his position. Side control again. 
Two minutes now to go in round two. Big body punch. Obvious redness now on the right side of his body, Joe. And full back. Going for that patented rear naked choke now. Now there's the body triangle. Tightens down the breathing. Now he switches it to the full rear naked choke. That rear naked choke is in deep. Any second now he may have to tap. Oh and there my it is. God! He got the choke for the tap. So yeah, it came down to tap out or go to sleep, and his opponent chose the former. The choke was clearly sunk in deep. Perfect technique. And ultimately, that is one of the bigger wins of his career. He gets it done by submission here tonight. And here we can see it again. That's a real tight choke here. And let's watch it here one more time. Deep submission and the tap. So a seminal moment for him here tonight, Joe Rogan, as he gets the win by way of submission. Certainly one of the bigger wins of his career and as big a statement as he could have made here tonight. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve Levine is going to stop to this contest at 3 minutes, 27 seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by tap out, Jusia Well, at this point, all that is left is the celebration, and it's nice to see this fighter sharing a moment with his coaches and training partners after the big submission win here tonight. He had no shortage of naysayers coming in. A lot of people said he couldn't come in here and submit a foe of this quality. Well, that should mute the masses a little bit. That should set him up for a big fight moving forward tonight. The